Uh, how do you plan on maximizing the return on taxpayer dollars already invested in the EFE program in terms of technology harvested and lessons learned? Well, as you pointed out, Congressman, the, the directive tells us to harvest as much of those technologies as is possible. We would much prefer to use the monies remaining in the, in the current contract to harvest that technology instead of paying termination fees. And so the plan that we're coming up with uh, to the very maximum extent possible gets those technologies so that we can use those and use the lessons learned as we develop the next amphibious assault vehicle as uh, General Amos talked about earlier today. Now, Mr. Secretary, let me ask you uh, um, a follow-up. How long do you anticipate it will be before you have a new amphibious tractor, uh, a new EFE or um, uh, at uh, initial operating capability? Well, I, uh, I absolutely agree with my comment. <laughs> okay. And, uh, but, but I do, I want to add one thing here. Um, we can build a new um, tracked amphibious assault vehicle in, in a reasonable amount of time. The EFV, had it been continued, would not have reached full operating capability until the mid-2020s. And we were going to have to do, have to take mitigating steps in terms of upgrading our AAVs, schlepping our AAVs, things like that, regardless of what uh, amphibious assault vehicles that we were doing. And uh, I think we ought to be able to build these things a lot quicker than we have historically. And as I said, I, I absolutely trust my commandant in his estimate. General Amos, any response? <laughs> sure, I think the, uh, <clears throat> the benefit of, I mean, it's regretful that we spent $3.2 billion over the last two and a half decades, and that, that pains me. Uh, I won't, I won't belabor why I came to the decision whether I want to recommend to my secretary. I won't do that here. But, but, but here's, the, here's the good news out of this thing. We will take a lot of that technology, a lot of, the, uh, uh, a lot of the capabilities that have been developed for the EFV to include the remainder of this year. And I have every expectation that we'll be able to translate some, if not a, 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 a large percentage of that, over to the amphibious combat vehicle. So... I, it will not all be lost to include the remainder of the monies uh, for this year, sir. Thank you, General Amos. Uh, 